Element shots. Ice shot. Okay. That's cool. What? How about that? Whoa, that's so powerful. Don't let it get too close. Why do you think I got bombs? That is so cool. Let's hurdle up, why not? I wonder if it'll work and pace, play some uh press music this time. I cannot fight beside you any longer, Rodent. Your battle skills are sloppy and erratic. My what? skills? You've got all That's the subtlety of a brain dead battering ram. Say the word, Peter Cloak, and I shall single-handedly tear these fiends apart. Let's go. We're gonna fight like a team. You keep tossing around. Are we a team, or should we just throw each other's lives away? Because the only thing that matters here is that we knock them out together. Who's with me? Die! Please. Can't wait to take him down. Feel it. Aw, it's, it's not playing any like online teams. Pointy death coming your way. Oh, 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 oh. Let's go. Are you implying that they are too hot? We're close, but we're gonna need to get up there. Those okay, elemental shots are fucking sick. Over. Ding, ding, ding! Give that man a gold star. Let's figure out how to make it climbable. Stars are made of hydrogen, not gold. Barely any power. Maybe we can muscle those cannons out. There's a little hole there. Might be able to work something loose from force. the inside. I'm the wreckage. Wonder if we can get anything mm. to pop out of the side of that wreck. Yeah, just try punching it, Joe. That always works. Come on, Quill. Let me get a look at them guns. Oh, Rocket, can you extend that cannon? With my brute animal strength? Drax, think you can drag this cannon out? I will try. Yeah, there we go. It is more stubborn than expected. If I never see another one of these ships again, it'll be too soon. Ah, impossible. Ah, okay, so we've got we'll to ice it up. You couldn't just hold it, Drax. Can you try again? Why? It does not stay. I'm working it out. Trust me. Okay, so we've got to ice, ice it up, man. Uh, I cannot hold it forever. Impressive, Peter Quill. There we go. Now we gotta get the next one out. That one. Bring that one out, boy. Drax, do you, uh. Send the abomination. It yeah, enjoys true. scrounging through refuse. I thought it might be Mark something like that. There we go. I need you to squeeze inside that little hole and try to knock the gun loose from the inside. Hello, the Atari ship full of booby traps and death mechanisms. But you love both those things. He does. Uh, you're right, I do. And I always wanted to see the inside of one of these bug bombers. Fine. Oh, what reeks in here? That's... Oh, Scott. Ah, ah. You okay Ew, there, Rocket? I found the crow. I guess not even the worms want to eat that Shatari meat. Rocket. Relax. Just gonna reroute a little bit of remaining power to the cannon and... I love Groot's design on this. Nothing. So cool. You know what? Flark it! I'm blowing it up! What? Hang on! Think about all the booby traps and... Big boom. <laughs> Look at it go! He must have jump-started the oh, thing. Oh, I've got now. Rocket, you okay? <laughs> yeah! And dry now, too! But well, didn't miss out then, apparently. Sorry, come on. There! Now we have our way up. Hey, there we go. 
Thank you. Clears a path through that junk. Sure. Yes, Peter Quill. Onward to the palace of the great giantess. Oh, Drax man. loves armor. Oh, that is not a happy monster. Well, at least it left. Back to its brood mother, Lady Hellbender. Oh, yeah, I doubt. Come on. Why is the bridge always on the wrong side? I could show it through rocket. Again, and I paint these cliffs <laughs> green. <laughs> okay, okay. No throwing and no shooting. Okay. There's gotta be another way across. We'll just look around. Lady Hellbender. Let me guess. She would have laid over the ravine and let us walk across on her back. I was going to explain that she would have thrown the woodland creature without hesitation. But your speculation is also possible. Okay. This could be interesting. The fortress is this way, Peter Quill. I know. I'm just doing some exploring. Ain't we done enough of that already? I'm pretty sure exploring is closed. It means you went the wrong way, but it's too stubborn to admit it. That is the greatest explorer I ever met. Alright. Allow it. Okay. I think I can see my house from here. What are you doing up there? Scout type stuff. Scouting. Looks like we uh need to keep going towards the fortress and not away from it. Excellent work, Peter. Also, it's just to get the components, is it? Shouldn't we at least have a leash for our monster? There's usually some acting involved in this kind of infiltration. The Hellbender is an astute buyer. Either she will want what we are selling. I'm with Gamora on this one. Hmm, okay, Looking we got this one. Guys, I've got something here. It's deep. Okay. This looks promising. There's little room to maneuver uh, should be, if something should, should be way around. We're not going to be here long. Anybody see a way through? We'll make one if we have to. Yep. Definitely something gross behind here. Okay. Drax. This looks like honey. That is disturbing. Oh, it's pony. Uh, I am clenching every orifice right now. Ooh. Hey, that's kind of weird. Hello? Anybody? Is there going to be something inside it? Whoa! Okay, that got my blood pumping. Why would Lady Hellbender cage this creature? Because uh, it's annoying as scud. Perhaps it is food. Hmm. That thing's food? Yes, monster food. I wonder what it tastes like. Peter. Why would it taste like that? I can use this. Monster food. The cage. We need the cage. We go into that fortress with our with our monster peacefully walking beside us. We'll be laughed right out of the room. Interesting. Why are you whispering? The more thinks we can sell our monster act better if we have a proper cage. Only problem is there's a pissed off monster inside. Release the beast. Let me dispose of it because that worked so well for you last time. We need a better plan. Yes. Ideally, one that guarantees my safety. Hundred percent. Oh no! Oh dear. That was gonna be two of them, I bet. Yep. Knew it. Stumpy's back. Somebody tell them what just happened. Let's go. Oh, mate. Wow. Did so much damage then. Yeah, let's have it. What are you going to do? Nothing. 
die. My god, oh my god. Come on, let's go. Come on. Oh my god, come on. Hey, wicked rapid jumps in case we can futile. Yeah, let's go. Have that. Flying Superman. Easy as that, mate. More, come to me, peace. <laughs> okay. You are coming with me. Okay. We take the cage. Uh, first rain. Then jelly, then slimy, stinky crawl spaces, and now all oh, these monsters. I hate this flarking planet. You hate everything, Rocket. She's not wrong. But especially the stinky slime tunnel part. Itchy That's right the is team. where I draw the line. Hey, we're a team. If we're gonna smell like butt, we're gonna smell like butt together. Hell yeah, we are. That is most eloquent, Peter Quill. I will smell like butt with you. Yeah, really great speech. Right, we will leave it there for today. Thank you very much for watching. Right, welcome back to another episode of my Guns Gats playthrough. Let's if keep it going. Our monster in it, will he shrink as well? Right, we're off to go see Lady Hellbender. Okay. And we've just found a cage to put Rocket in because Rocket is going to be presented as the monster to hit Lady Hellbender. Hmm. This way? I guess we could open the bridge anyway. That's not where we need to go, is it? Hmm. So, what do we do if all don't go well with Lady Ink? We're gonna fight a monster queen? She would be a formidable adversary indeed. Lady Hellbender isn't her adversary. If all goes well, she's gonna be our business partner. And if all don't go well? Oh, this way. Cool. I'm Groot. Groot says we should check things out over here. There we go. When are the rest of us gonna get jet boots? Never. It takes years of special training to operate these things. You had years of jet boot lessons. No, but the guy I took them off of did. You Ball. stole them. He was dead. Flew into a ceiling fan. Go on, Groot. Groot, give me a bridge here. The fortress is right on the other side of those cliffs. Danke. Ah. Pretty right. sure it's this way. <laughs> Deep freeze. Can I try ice cubing something? Nope. Nope. Man, you're such a gas flat. So if we're gonna haggle with the monster, please, how much are we asking for our monster? 395 million units, give or take two. One for every precious hair follicle on this flawless body. You have counted them. That is bizarre. Hey, at least I have some to count. Oh, it was two of them. Okay. I was wondering why it wasn't working. No, it huh. ain't. What the tree say? He says all this moisture is good for us and will make us grow. <laughs> Spoken just as the tree would. Whoa, that is definitely my top Lady held by Miss Fortresses. Let's go. Oh shit. What the floor? That that quarantine zone monster was supposed to be rare. She already has a whole herd of them. So we wasted our time. That's Almost mad. Got killed for nothing. And got arrested. That was fun. It was moderately amusing. Now we've got a ticking time Stay bomb on the, on the Come ship. On. Guys, every misstep was just a step in the right direction towards completing our best plan yet. Bit PMA, mate. Again? Bit PMA. What if we brought one of those ugly suckers all the way here? Only. Well, let's just get this done. What's that?
That's cool, man. You can't be serious. Okay. It's farther than it looks. Big old bridge. Much farther. It's a flocking infinity bridge, is what it is. Are you being dramatic, Rodent? Bridge ends at the fortress, therefore it's not. Yeah, that's super comforting. Guess we gotta go. Recycles. Look how the rain's shimmering off of the morning. Peter? Jesus. Aren't you forgetting something? Oh, right. Cage. When we can get the park and things looking like we business. All right, Rocket. Time to put on your monster face. I only got one face, Quill. Are you sure about this, Peter? <laughs> Look at him. You better have one hell of a sales pitch. Yeah, let's go. Remind me again. How many missions have we been on so far? Thirteen. Fourteen, if you count contracts. Contracts. Not a whole yeah, lot then. Mission. It was a mistake. All right. Point is, is I was able to sell you, Gamora, daughter of Thanos, intergalactic assassin, as a hero. Fourteen times. <laughs> Fine. I think he's made his point. Mate, look at Drax, <laughs> mate. The guy's built like a brick shit house, bro. Drax. Gamora, can you help me with no. this? What? Why? To guarantee your safety as a leader. Oh, come on. <laughs> She's got you there, Quill. Now okay. shut up and start pulling. Should be Groot can do it, right? Stop worrying so much. You're gonna start growing knots again. Okay, hmm. here we okay. go. This is a very, very long bridge. Whoa! Okay, whoa, whoa! A little bit close. They seem so peaceful here. Never saw a real well when I was a kid. I guess this sort of counts. I'm sure it's real pretty, but can we not draw its attention while I'm stuck in a flarkin cage, please? Okay, cutscene. Cool. Oh, what? Oh, that's what this is the um, this is a very Does beautiful day. Have, like a campfire song or something we can sing to kill the time. Ooh, ooh, I know one. It's called. Please stop. All right, yeah. Okay. Wait, is please stop the name of your song? No. Okay. So, how long before someone else wants to pull this thing? We are sixty clicks from the fortress. I'd say closer 60. to seventy-five. But there is that's, only one way. To even I know that's a lot of clicks. 0.1 clicks. 0 0.2 clicks. 0 0.9. 2.1. 0 0.3 clicks. 4.5. Oh my god. 0 0.4 clicks. 0 0.5 clicks. 0 0.6 clicks. Okay, that's quite good now. It's a bit jewelry, this bit. Which is uh, annoying. There we go. Seems to have stopped now. That's cool. Star Lord. Backflash. Flashback. Backflash. What am I going to talk about? Okay. Let's go back to the childhood. Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec, I promise. Right. Let's get out of bed then. Oh, we get to explore more of the house now. This would be so cool. Raccoon. Be warm enough to spend the night in the yard soon. I love falling asleep looking at the stars, wondering what might be out there. Oh, 
He says you can get a brain parasite if you share a toothbrush. Imagine that. Absolutely correct. Something growing inside of you, slowly taking over. Ooh, fridge. Close to the opening. Mom says Grandpa used to play this a lot when she was a kid. But it's been busted ever since I can remember. Oh, let's go see what squad looks like. Oh, it's her birthday. I love the well, Pac-Man design. Well, 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 look who decided to finally come up. Where's my cake? I warned you. <laughs> no, you didn't. I am so full. Mom. Oh. Okay, sit your butt down, Slowpoke. That cake is fucking awesome. Don't worry, awesome. I'm not gonna sing. I like your singing. Well, you might be the only one. Go on, make a wish. You're officially a teenager. Look at all those girlfriends. Someone's gonna be really popular at school. Mom. What? You are very handsome. I'm sure all the girls are gonna be falling off. Mom. Over. What did you wish for? Why would I wish for anything? I've got everything I want. <laughs> oh, what huge favor are you about to ask me? Just ten bucks. Dan, Andy, and I want to go see Night of the Cosmos at the Rio tonight. A movie? Tonight? Come on. Hmm. It's going to be sick. It's about these she zombies that invade Earth, and then it's up to these kids that have to blow them away. Is she expected something to I happen? I don't think I want you to see that, Peter. I let you watch the hockey mask one, and you were... Sleeping in my bed the next three nights. Hmm. Close that one. was ages ago. And this one isn't even that bad. It's PG-13. And I'm 13. Exactly. PG-13 may contain violence and nudity. Mild nudity. Like, butts and we stuff. We love a butt. You're not helping your case. <laughs> no, I just, I... I wanted us to... Have some us time tonight, you know? Maybe finish our game. You can't duck out right when I'm about to win. We can still do all that stuff. Or some of it. Tomorrow. You're always telling me to get out of the house more. A movie theater does not count as out of the house. It definitely does. It. Pretty please? I don't know. Truck's still in the shop, and I don't want you walking alone in the dark. She's There's expecting a lot of something to happen. Out there. It's not safe. She definitely is. I'll be careful, Ma. I always am. Were you careful when you got that black eye? I told you I, I was. I know. You were standing up for someone, which is a good thing. But you cannot go punching your way out of every problem, Peter. I couldn't just stand there. No, of course not. Okay, get me my purse. Not so fast. Before you go, there's something I want to talk to you about, something I want to give you. 20 bucks? <laughs> Don't push. Cheeky. Think of it as a long overdue gift from your father. It's upstairs on my bed. Go on and get it while I finish up in the kitchen. And we can open it together. For my father? Hmm. Interesting. Aww. Yeah, hey, Kubrick, buddy. No matter how long you wait here for Grandma and Grandpa, they're not coming back. Sorry. Aww. Aww. Good boy. The longer you wait to get that gift, the more likely I am to change my mind about the movie. The no way, you wouldn't. Try me. Sometimes Grandma and Grandpa would let me sleep okay, with them if I was too afraid down in the basement. Let's go get this gift. There it is. Wonder what it could be. A 
That's smart. 